Christmas. No one ever was. Merry Christmas. She catches them as my real test. To train them is my cause. I will travel across oh. the land, searching yeah. far and wide. Let's go. It will be my best. Best since I have posted on this channel and I'm ready to get back into things I hope you're ready to get back into things too so as you could probably tell by the intro to this video I am wanting to expand my horizons past Pokemon a bit of course Pokemon is still gonna be probably the main thing I'm doing on this channel but I also grew up on things like Yu-Gi-Oh too which I there's obviously some pretty cool stuff out there we can open up for that too, but there's a whole bunch of stuff like Dragon Ball cards, Magic the Gathering, there's even some Disney stuff that's out there too. So let me know if there's any particular cards you would want me to open, and if there's enough requests, then we'll get right into it. But I know what you're all thinking. Tony, it's been literally two years since you've posted a video. Are you going to open anything in this? Don't worry. I got y'all covered. All right, let's get into this opening. So today we are gonna be opening up this build and battle box of Twilight Master Raid. So let's get this opened up first of all. One and two and up. All right, now that we've got this opened up, let's see what we got inside. So for those of you who don't really know, the, the, the build and battle boxes are uh, basically the stuff that um, they release right before the set releases, you know, in general and then uh, they basically, the point of the this is to basically build a deck out of it so that you can, uh, um, you know, it's part of the pre-release tournament and you can basically, you know, build your own deck that, uh, you can get some really good cards out of this too, but yeah, you basically battle people with it and I know most card shops can usually give you like, you know, a free pack or something like that. They usually give you some free stuff, but, but and this is, it always comes with a pre-release card too. We have the Frost Last pre-release. In this case, this is a cool Frost Last holographic pre-release card. So we'll definitely be sleeving that one up. And of course, uh, oh, some trainer tip card there or whatever that is. And then as you see, see, it gives you a whole bunch of cards where you can just, you know, it gives you basically a starter deck, you know, something to start off with. And then, uh, yeah, you can just build from here and then yeah, kick some butt. If y'all know me, you know I don't really play the game that well, so don't come to me for knowing how to play the game or any rules or stuff like that, because I wouldn't have a clue. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm strictly a collector. Go ahead and get our floss laugh sleeved up there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. All right, let's get into the packs. Let's get into the meat and bones of this opening. So. I'm glad to be I'm glad to be back opening cards with you guys. It's been far too long, way overdue, and yeah, I am ready to open up some cards with y'all. So there shouldn't be a pack trick with these uh, the new Scarlet and Violet packs. They should automatically have the uh, best card in the back. And with these ones, you're pretty much always guaranteed. You are guaranteed a hollow in every pack. So that is one of the things they've fixed with these um you're pretty much guaranteed a hit in every pack for the most part and, oh look at that we have got ourselves a greninja ex to start off that is awesome so okay we do have the energy in the back so that will be something we will have to go over next time we'll have to flip that but not a bad hey not a bad start to the opening already we got an awesome it's an awesome pokemon like greninja too so hell yeah really cool really cool all right Pack number two, let's get into this. 
So I know I kind of mentioned this in the description or in the intro video, but what other uh, packs would you like to see me open? There's literally so many uh, um, other trading cards we can get into rather than just Pokemon, you know, but of course Pokemon's gonna be my biggest thing because it's one of the best. I wanna be the very best like no one ever was. So you get what I'm doing with that. Oh, all right. A Tatsu Duri. Um, this is the character rares. They used to call them character rares in the uh, Sword and or in the Sun and Moon era. I'm not sure exactly what they call them now, but still pretty cool. And a Sinistcha, regular holographic card. So yeah, that like I said, those are part of the hollows in uh, basically every pack that you get now. So yeah, that's pretty neat. All right, pack number two, halfway through this, and I'm gonna be posting the new video every Wednesday. So every Wednesday you'll guarantee, guaranteed at least one new video, but I'll also be doing some special openings too, um, in case you got, you know, for the really cool ones, like a collector's edition or like one of the premium collections. Like if I were to have the Charizard premium collection, that would definitely count as a special, but got a lot of stuff planned for you all. So be sure you are, subscribe so that you don't miss out on those and i'm just super super happy to be getting back into this with you all so all right got the leafeon oh that's a pretty cool one the swirlix holograph or reverse holographic and a walking weight holographic this is actually one of the uh what do you call them the paradox pokemon of the um the, they call them the three legendary dogs, even though they're based off cats, which is, I think is pretty weird, but yeah, pretty neat. All right, last pack here. Let us see if we can finish off strong. So far, we got the Greninja and the Tatsuguri character card. So let's see what we can finish off here. And we have the Dark Energy at the back. We have a Finizen, Watro, a Glimit, Wacky, Carmine, Heracross, Palafin, Festival Grounds, Reverse Hollow, Sans, ooh, there we go, Sans Slash Reverse Hollow, that's pretty neat. And let's see if we can finish off strong on our last, oh, oh well, hey, not too bad for the first opening since two years, so I'm pretty happy with this. We got the Tatsuguri character card, and I, I, I like how they got like all three of the forms on here too, which is pretty cool. And of course the Greninja EX. So, all right guys, I'm back. So thank you all again for joining me. I hope you all um, stayed subscribed for those who have stayed subscribed for the two years that I've been silent. Thank you very much. I hope you will enjoy the new videos that I have. I'm planning on doing more production behind these, better quality. So I hope you all enjoy them and I'll see you all on the next one.